Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. After getting pooped out there from the special mission, I'm actually going to be walking back rather than warping back through the don't attack me blaze again. <laughs> I'm going to be walking back through here because it's just going to work out a whole lot better from the plan that I have here. So what I'm going to do is look for two Paris. I don't remember where, oh, okay. <laughs> I don't remember where they are at this point in the game, but I managed to find one. That is awesomeness. <laughs> and I also like to grab um, a Machop on the way back as well, because I got that smashy move. That'll come in handy for a different area. So there we go. Uh -huh. You'll see what these will come in handy for on my way back. Well, actually, you probably know what they're for, um, because this was something really, really early on in the game. Well, maybe not that early for the smashy, smashy part, but, uh, did I get you before? Yeah, I did. But, uh, the thing is, is that there were those two bushes that I could cut just outside the cave. Wow, you're doing it quite the dance there, Macho. <laughs> oh, 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 you, you do your, okay. I was gonna say, you do your attack while I'm not circling, and that will work out nicely, but it, eh, it worked out nicely anyway. <laughs> And I think I, that is all I need in the cave. I think so. Hopefully, I'm gonna not have to come back here until I come back here for other stuff. <laughs> and speaking of other stuff, um, I will actually be, pre be preparing for that cave in the outdoor uh, foresty area here by collecting the necessary Pokemon needed to 100% the cave as well, so I'll be preparing for that this part. Sounds good? Good. First, the slash slash slash, or scratch scratch scratch, or cut cut cut, yes! And now we can go in here and see a Bulbasaur. Yeah, a Bulbasaur. Look at that, that's where they were the whole time. <laughs> well, actually, I think you can get them in the, the Plains Capture Challenge as well, but you were probably curious to see what was inside these holes, and we haven't really been able to go back here for quite a while. Now, we need that cross field move there. In fact, we need two more cross field moves, so I'm going to be holding that Bulbasaur in my party for a good while. Um, I'll also be getting to Ivysaur over at the deeper forest area while I do my route through there to get uh, something in the deepest part of the forest. Don't, don't, no, no, no. <laughs> So what I'm no don't no no don't don't panic everything's okay just relax I'll I'll just be cutting that bush from a distance but yeah basically this is a this is kind of complicated to plan out but I did my best on it and we'll see how things go I guess <laughs> so in here yeah in here are just two combuskin and I don't want to battle them but that's all that there's in there nothing else even if you capture them so I guess you can grab them if you want but we're not gonna need anything fiery. And now that we come all this way back down the route, we can go into the deeper, darker, spookier, more dangerous part of the forest. Ooh, Ivysaur. <laughs> I need you, yes, so I will capture you. I'll also be grabbing uh, something that can cut a lot, like say a Scyther. Uh, but we'll, uh, oh, I got a little scared that it was going to attack again. Okay, just, okay, just, what are you going to, okay, one... Ooh, one vine and we're okay. <laughs> All is well. And there. Now, over here... Remember this boulder? That's what I grabbed the Machop for. And... Break this open! Well, break it apart, and we can cross over. Now, over here is a war turtle, which I don't believe I got before, even in some sort of... Team... Grocket Go-Go... I'm just kidding. <laughs> Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I know it's the Gold Rock Squad. I'm just joking around. <laughs> and there we go. Yep, I was correct. We did not get a War Turtle. Look at those apples. <laughs> All right, so I don't need the War Turtle for anything. I, like, I don't need to douse anything or, or whatnot. It's just a thing of that I needed for my browser. So I popped over here to catch one. Um, I will catch this as well, because as I said, need more... Need more crossing moves. Haha! Uh, I have mastered the art of the capture on an emulator now. <laughs> but will it be enough? Will it be enough? We shall see. I don't want to get in trouble with that one, so I'm just gonna evade that. There's the scyther that I'm looking for. <laughs> and I will get that scyther. This is sort of a gate in the Croca Tunnel. 
So, ooh, I gotta wait, gotta wait for it to sit still for a good amount of time, and then I'll be able to circle it. I notice that's that's how it works. Oh, oh, oh I touched it. Dang it! I lost my opportunity. Oh, oh! <laughs> it's just the too many jumpies. No jumpies. No jumpy. Stop. Stop. Okay. Oh, that was late. <laughs> Mm -hmm. ah. Relax, relax, all is well, okay. <laughs> and there we go. Got that bad boy. And... Now, oh, wait, what am I going back this way for? <laughs> I'm gonna catch, catch the Scyther again on my way back through here. But I, d I just need something else to be able to cut for something coming up. By the way, we cannot go through this. You know, we could come through it the other way. We can't actually go through it that way, so we gotta actually take the whole route around. But it's cool because we'll be able to see some stuff that whoop, stuff that whoop, <laughs> stuff that we haven't seen before. Like say, uh, you know those Pokemon that uh, the Go Rock Squad got released and we captured them. Well, you'll find a good chunk of them out in the forest here. Uh, I don't want to get all weeping, Bill, though. <laughs> Uh, I am looking for a Swellow. I'll need that for the cave later. So pick one up where- oh, here we go. Swallow, Swallow, Swallow. Haha! -ha. Battle me if you dare! Actually, it's probably gonna have more of an advantage over me than I will over it. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Victory! Okay. Now, I'm gonna try and get through here without- oh shoot, I took a day. <laughs> I was gonna say without getting slurped up by a Weeping Bell. Uh, because at the end of this, where we found Gordor, is a victory bell. And we have, whoa, we have absolutely have got to get that one for our browser. Oh, I took another dead. Mm. Ah, I know it's been a while since I've been through here in the walkthrough, but still. Eh, eh, I should know the game better than that. Oh, <laughs> I tried to avoid it. And run we go. <laughs> Not too concerned about capturing everything along the way, because it's just going to make me reorganize my party anyway. And I've got plenty of line width as well as uh, health there, so I'm all good to go. Oh, oh, come on, let me- thank you. <laughs> There's Victory Bell. Oh! Well, that that's, n that's not what I was going for, but yeah, they can do that too. Just like the Weeping Bell, you gotta get them from behind. Uh, well, I could just like zoop, zoop around here. There we go. <laughs> Alright, let's see if I can catch this one. Without any Poké Assists, maybe, maybe, maybe? Got some poison. That was easy. <laughs> and another one bites the dust for my browser. Oh yeah! Not a difficult one to capture by any means, but gotta get it for the browser. Now we still have to go through this route here. It's this route- oh shoot! Oh! <laughs> Beedrill, I forgot they were here. How could I have forgotten they were here? Well, I'm running from everyone that I see if I can! <laughs> this is so much faster than I am. It's, you can sometimes get them like stuck on a, you know, like stuck on a tree or something like that, but more often than not, they're gonna get you. <laughs> Alright, now, uh, this is, oh, this isn't the split pathway yet. Uh, see, there's the Beautifly that one of the Team Go- I mean, the, the Gorok Squad, I was gonna say the Team Rocket joke again, but no. Gorok Squad, and now we gotta go through the split path. Remember, it's down, up, down? Was it? Was it? Please tell me it was. It was something very simple to remember, which I'm hoping that I'm gonna remember, because it'll speed things along greatly. And, 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 oh, oh, don't get seen by the Swallow, we don't need any more trouble. <laughs> And there we go, reaching this set portion of the woods. Look at that, look at that. We've never seen this one before, have we? That's a Shedinja. And it disappears out of existence, and then pops back in. We're, well, it does eventually. <laughs> I will like to, mm, I just want to get it solo, but I guess that the Pampy is going to have to get in it. Well, it's going to have to get in it. It just keeps teleporting right next to where it shouldn't be. <laughs> so I'm going to grab that. There we go. It's a lot like a Haunter, really, in terms of catching and whatnot. Okay. There we go. So now that I'm done here... Oh, shoot. Uh, yes. I don't need you. I don't need you. Uh, I don't need you. And I don't need you, even though I just got you. 
Okay, so I'm just gonna reorganize my party. So this is basically what you sh Oh shoot, I forgot to get something that I was supposed to cut. Ah! Back at uh, this portion of the forest with the weeping bell and stuff. Ah, uh, where was that spot? Where... I know it was on like the southern end of it, but it's... It's guarded by a weeping bell. That's kind of why I avoided the corner before. Wait, I think this is it right here. Yeah, this is the route. You go around here, and see this one right here? I'm gonna cut that with my scythery friend, and I'm gonna catch one on my way back. There we go. Now, by chopping that up, we can go inside and find a Typhlosion! Yeah, Typhlosion! They exist in this game! <laughs> So we're gonna try and catch this one. It does these fiery, fiery blast waves around its body, like that. And ah, it's kind of hard to find an opportunity to circle it. I might just end up discharging, but we'll see if I can get it regular way here. Oh, come on now, man. <laughs> Work with me here. Okay. Woo! <laughs> and there we go. Alrighty, now that I got that, let's go back over to the Scyther. Hey, Weeping Bell, where are you? Where? Oh, of course there's no Weeping Bell when I need a Weeping Bell to travel back a little bit quicker here. Hey, hey, you, you, yeah, yeah, I, I'm, 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 yeah, you're hungry, of course you are, there we go. <laughs> so, basically why I've got this collection of Pokemon here, well, besides the Typhlosion, but what I'm going to be doing is going back to the cave and utilizing their abilities. I'm not sure if I'll be able to do it all this part, but I'll at least get up to, say, the Makuhita Dojo type place. Oh, that, must, that was probably a good place to circle, but... Oh, you got me! <laughs> or something like that. We'll see where I get, because the upcoming spot is kind of annoying to get through, so, <laughs> so it's, it just takes a couple of passes through and I keep, gotta keep catching Makuhitas and Machamps along the way, so it just takes... Wait, did I get you before? Yeah, I did. It was with that um, Go Rock Squad peep, I believe. But yeah, um, now what I'm gonna do with all these Pokémon, well, except, you know, minus Typhlosion, is go back over to the cave and then I'll be able to do some shenanigans that I wasn't able to do before because I wasn't able to take Pokemon from one environment to another, plus there wasn't all these Pokemon really here to do the dirty work. So yeah, I, I think... I, yeah, I do believe I've got everything that I need right here, as long as I do everything appropriately. <laughs> Let's just put it that way. Oh, actually, I noticed that the time is at uh, about 13 minutes now, so maybe, maybe I'll push that off in the next part. So I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part when I get to some rather tedious stuff. 